called Lord Beaker Lodge. And right beside Lord Beaker Lodge then would be uh, the Emerson Hotel. So we can walk over there. First it was a tent city, and then that was a, uh, it would change into a hard okay. wood uh, huh. a part of the cottage city. Huh. Now if you notice on your map where it mentions about the cottage city, this, this uh, baseball field here, Right over here on this side, on the hill there in this man's uh, yard, is a little tiny tan building. That's an example of one of those cottages. There were 40 of them all sitting here. And it wasn't quite that smooth either. It was, you know, rather rolling, so some of the cottages were a little higher than others. But that's basically it. Big enough for a, a single bed, maybe, maybe a chair, a little washstand, things like that. And that's what you could rent. And this gentleman is perfectly fine if anybody wants to actually go and look. He is trying to um, renovate it. What's the word, Randy? Yeah, re <laughs> yeah renovate it. Kind of restore it. But it's not. He's not period correct. The rest restoration. He's not it's period just correct. But just if, in case you want to see it, just how big they were, yeah, feel and, free. And he, he, he said, said fine. You're, we're welcome to walk right up yeah. there and, 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 and look at it. If you want to go these people could purchase them and put them on their own property and they could use them as their own guest house and like i say the people that i grew up with out here who were resorters when i was little some of them actually had these little guest houses right and people would visit they would stay in those things but they're right next to their cottage i mean these things are kind of like your camp in the new one where you should go to summer camp yeah. People could either person purchase them for their yard. Oh, that's one too, huh? We'll yeah, yeah. Here. With the lean-to on it? Yeah, but the okay. lean-to would be added. But yeah, you can yeah, sort of see yeah. where the original would have been. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And obviously there's a window set with clap on that. Okay. Changes. Uh -huh. This is all screen. Now, what do you mean by screen? It was screen. It was screened in. It wasn't. Oh, okay. It was open. It was not. Oh, okay. So it was screened. In. Okay, I got you. It was like a kind of a, mm -hmm. you know, this did this like swing open here? Hey, where that hook is there or no? No, uh, what they would do is they had canvas tarps to roll up. Okay. They drop the canvas tarp down over the. So street. that'd be the okay. All right. Hmm. In fact, we got a. Is that, a, original, is that an original light fixture up there? Sure, looks like it, don't it? I'm not sure. Okay. Now the other thing is that when you if you're going inside, there's there's only the outside covering. There's nothing inside. Mm -hmm. you know, whereas you know, when he's doing the restoration, he's putting panels right, on the inside. Right. Uh, we have a sketch of one of these, and I'm looking into maybe trying to semi recreate that. Okay. Bold in that when I was oh, about six cool. years old, oh, but it didn't let. Okay. Yeah, it was. That was in well, we're 42. Still standing in the 40s. Yeah. In the 40s, okay. but it caved in with the snow. The um, one, one winter. <laughs> in 19, I was reading the Couriers again. In 1936 or the 35, 36 that year, the snow ruined the men's club, the cafeteria, the bath. They just caved in, mm -hmm. and part of it probably, I'm guessing was due to the fact that they were not necessarily used because of the depression. So right, it was, and it you know, piled up. But yeah. the clubhouse was damaged. They <laughs> fixed it up. They didn't actually tear the clubhouse down until 1946. Part of that was still there when we moved here. Okay. And, and yeah. some of 
some of that cement was there's Oscar found a piece of it, didn't you? <laughs> Tonight when we were walking through. But part of that, the, the cement sidewalks and so forth were there when these kids were little yet. I remember. Yeah. 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 They were they were there until about oh, sure. ten years ago. Yeah, the snowmobiles. You could yeah. let your kids do yeah. that. So um, right right beside his house, now you'll notice a lot of trees, a lot of trees till the end. If you get in the middle of those trees, you find a, a cement foundation. Now that would be uh, number 11. Okay, that was the Emerson Hotel, also known as the Lakewood Hotel. Okay, that stood there. So as you can see, if you took the train in, you get off right there, you can get your hotel room here or your cottage, and you're right there at the clubhouse, and you're right there on the beach. So it really made it very comfortable. Very nice. So is this building on here? This building is, this man's house is number 10. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Pretty much looks the same other other than his screens. You know, the screens, but he's put windows in. But it does look a lot the same. All right. Now, just. This over. There was something that cement off and have a yard sale. That works. But I don't know what it is. Look to me about the right size for a garage. That was another historical thing for the Chicago yeah. people. They picked mushrooms, beers, yes. uh, millers, um, all yeah. of morales. that. Morales. Morales. They picked them, canned them, sent them back. They had a going <laughs> business. Send them back to Chicago to the restaurants. Yeah. You couldn't do that now, but they did then. They, yeah. canned, they all picked families, huge families, and mm -hmm. picked. They don't tell people where morales are. Yeah. It's just a big they secret. Do. They got away with canning them. The only other thing I'd like to mention here on this uh, flyer is that um, for those of you who may not have heard that I was mentioning, in the very top corner here, the Lakewood School, for those of you from Whitehall, which I assume most of you are from Whitehall, you can see this building, it's still around. It is right next to the Whitehall bus garage over there on Elliott, I think it is, and Livingston. I Okay. Been, yeah. It's sitting right there. That that was that was uh, situated way on the other side of the Russell Road, and they had a student student. Uh, you know, as you can see in the picture, 10, 13, maybe 15 kids. Not a whole lot of kids went there. One room. One room. Uh -huh. Okay, but then it was uh, obviously integrated into the Whitehall school system, and so they moved the building <coughs> actually over to Whitehall. No. They, Thank you for letting us no problem. wander around here. Yeah, the community now, you know,